Hollywood actors were celebrating the end of their months-long strike in the early hours of Thursday after their union SAG-AFTRA reached a tentative deal with major studios valued at more than $1 billion. The second of two industry strikes this year took 118 days to resolve as performers demanded higher pay in the streaming TV era and protection from being replaced by AI-generated digital replicas. We have a lot of our strike captains on the line that have been close to eviction and have had their only meal of the day be while they're striking. So it has not been easy. It's such a feeling of joy and of, of triumph over adversity and not quitting. Sagaftra said the agreement involves a new three-year contract that includes raises in minimum salaries and a new streaming participation bonus. It also provides protections against unauthorized use of images generated by artificial intelligence. The union's chief negotiator, Duncan Crabtree Ireland, said the deal will make a long-term difference for actors. That's by far the largest set of gains we've ever achieved in a contract negotiation. And there's really important protections built into this contract around things such as artificial intelligence protections and also including um, making sure that now there is a a stream of revenue coming off of the streaming business that can actually sustain middle-class actors who are trying to make a career in, in streaming. He also praised union president Fran Drescher for her courage and compassion during the strike. Drescher, the star of 90s sitcom The Nanny, celebrated on Instagram that, we did it, the billion-plus dollar deal. Sagaftra said its negotiating committee unanimously backed the agreement with the Alliance of Motion Picture and Television Producers, which represents Walt Disney, Netflix and other media companies. The Alliance said Wednesday's agreement represented a new paradigm and that it, quote, looks forward to the industry resuming the work of telling great stories. The union's national board will consider the agreement on Friday and said it would release further details afterwards. The breakthrough means Hollywood can ramp up to full production for the first time since May, once union members vote to ratify the deal in the coming weeks. The Writers Guild of America went on strike for almost five months starting early May, while the actors began picketing in mid-July. The non-profit Milken Institute estimates the combined strikes cost California more than $6 billion in lost output.